Iron Man, John Bothy, the fine track announcer here at the Meadowlands, take it away. All right, thanks a lot, uh, Bruce. And if certainly a horse with a home field advantage, it is the Iron Horse Hot Lead because he has just sparkled here at the Meadowlands. He can win any way on the front end or coming from behind like he did last week. Here they come for the second Governor Driscoll of the Nation. And they're off. It's Bahama Bunny for the lead. Up on the far outside, Dr. Lecter Lobel. With Ombro Operative in third, around the first turn. And Campbell hustles Dr. Lecter Lobel to the front by a length and a half. Bahama Bunny second by four. Ombro Operative third by three. Then it's the Wrath of Pan. Sacramania. Hot lead is about a dozen lengths for the lead early. Toon Town Trails. Opening quarter, 27 and one. Off the turn down the back stretch. And Dr. Lecta Lobel. There by two. Bahama Bunny and Moise have second. That's a wide gap of some six lengths back to Ombro Opera. Another two and a half to the Wrath of Pan. Then it's two to Hot Lead, who's in gear on the outside, looking for some cover. After that, it's Sacramania and Toontown. And by the half, and Campbell, as he did in the first elimination, leads by the half in 55 and four. This time, it's with Dr. Lecter Lobel. Bahama Bunny second. Ombro Operative takes to the outside third. And the Wrath of Pan in fourth. Sacramania fifth. Hot Lead continues in sixth. Then it's Toontown. They approach three quarters. And Dr. Lecter Lobel enjoys a length lead. Moiseev and Bahama Bunny have carved out a perfect trip. Three quarters. 123 and three, and they're on their way home. And Dr. Lobel. Campbell trying to go all the way. Leads it by two and a half. Bahama Bunny in second. Up on the outside, the Wrath of Pan. And Hot Lead in deep stretch. It's Dr. Lecter Lobel. He eats them alive tonight. Campbell in one. 50 and one. And Bruce and Gary, John Campbell, went to the lead. This time he had the same kind of half mile as he did in the first elimination, 55 and four. But the doctor was up to the task. What a performance by Campbell and Dr. Lecter Lobel. Winner, Dr. Lecter Lobel in the second elimination the of the Driscoll. Bell. Here in the winner's circle with winning driver John Campbell, the sport's most successful, was the second difference by the three quarters, 123 and three tonight, 122 and three last week, the difference for the good doctor? I think so, and he had to uh, start in, and we'd been off three weeks before his last race, and I think could just tighten him up for tonight. 27 and one wasn't that fast to the quarter, but there was a couple of big gaps behind it. Yeah, there's not a lot of early speed in that race. Uh, he got to the front relatively easy, and he, he, when he got to the second quarter, in, or second quarter in that moderately, I thought he'd be tough to beat. How does he feel right here coming down the stretch? You have about three on the rest of the field. Well, he, he has a tendency to just get a little lackadaisical, but if he keeps attention, he paces right down to the wire, and, and he was still pacing strong right at the wire. John, congratulations to you and the connections of Dr. Lecter Lobel. We're heading back to Bruce. John Campbell just missed a sub-150 mile, which would have been his first here at the Meadowlands. Dr. Lecter Lobel lighting up the board, 1885, 80 and 210. Hot lead second, 320 and 210. Armbro operative, part of the entry, finished third, 210. The exact to 5, 4, 64, 80. And the odds come through, a $5 wager returns $11.30. The doctor comes through in flying colors. <laughs> 